we will start this video by bringing disappointing news to many Kules fans about a player considered extremely important by many. There were expectations that Frankie de Jong would return to play on Sunday in the match against Girona as it was believed that he would already have recovered from his injury, however, nothing went as expected and the news is not good at the moment. De Jong's injury would still be causing the player pain, but he refuses to undergo the surgery recommended by Barcelona, and as a result, the player's return to the field still has no set date. Furthermore, Frankie de Jong does not want to renew his contract with Barcelona which ends in 2026, which is a serious blow for Barcelona who are at risk of losing him for free as no club wanted to buy him now because he was injured. All of this would mean that the relationship between Frankie de Jong and Barcelona could end in a bad way, so the club's board would be looking for friendlier solutions with the player. Do you consider Frankie de Jong an important player for Barcelona? Leave your opinion here in the comments. Now let's move on to the main news, exclusive last-minute bomb. PSG is well known for stealing stars from Barcelona, as has previously happened with Neymar and Messi for example, and almost happened with La Maina Mall, Pedri and Pauqui Barsi at the beginning of the year, and now another important Barcelona player would also be in PSG's sights and is at great risk of being bought for a millionaire value by the Parisian club. In the last few hours it was confirmed that PSG would be interested in signing striker Rafinha and the Parisian club would be willing to pay 70 million euros for the player. Despite his protagonism in Barcelona's recent matches, Rafinha is not considered non-negotiable and Barcelona almost sold him in this last transfer window for almost 100 million euros to an Arab club, however, Rafinha rejected the offer. Now, PSG will try to sign the player in January and there is a good chance that Barcelona will accept the offer considering that 70 million euros is a lot of money and Rafinha is not a non-negotiable player, however, for the deal to happen, Barcelona will need to convince Rafinha to also accept the offer. Given this, in your opinion, are you against or in favor of selling Rafinha for 70 million euros to PSG? Do you think it would be a good deal? Tell me here and I'll be reading your comment, I'll see you in the next video.